just rinse it guys just rinse it just take out the the smell put some ginger on it just blanch a little bit don't do it too long Okay guys, let's start cooking. Saute the laurel, star anise, garlic and ginger. Put a little bit oil. Don't put too much because the beef later will come out an oil. So just put a little bit only. And then you must put the beef brisket. You must put it beef and make it sure that the garlic and ginger start on is the fragrance first before you put the meat. Put some pepper, guys. To make more the aroma stronger. Just toast a little bit brown so that the aroma will come out. Every time I fry a meat, I will do it until a little bit brown. And some oil, some oil also. Except in here so that it won't be very very fat okay. and this is the other one here we are, I think I can throw it here, you yeah. know. Yeah. I could be, there is already a water on there. So that it will be, it will be more quick to boil. Okay. And then just like that. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Here we go. Here we Here are the ingredients, guys. This is one. Joho paste. Oyster sauce. Lak sauce. And Chinese wine. And daikon guys, white radish, we're gonna put it later. Jojo paste. Just try one first. Okay. This is the Chinese wine. Black sauce. black sauce and oyster sauce okay. 
boil for one hour just wait for one hour and we will check it later after 30 minutes I just put the white radish because it's already soft for 1 hour and 15 minutes I just put it let make it soft the white radish The radish is already soft. Again, lang natin ng cornstarch. Cornstarch. Para mas konting lako. To make the gravy more thicker and look yummy. Ready to serve now guys. It's done. Hope you enjoy my videos. Please subscribe. Thanks for watching guys. See you again on my next video. Bye bye.